I don't think there's anything in my house I've wanted to do less than this closet. Hi friends, in today's video we are tackling, you guessed it, my garage. Just kidding, it's my closet. Yeah, I really don't want to do it. I haven't done it since I moved in and it's time. I know that I'll feel better after I do it and I do feel better knowing that I'm not doing it alone. This video is in collaboration with my sweet friend Amy Robinson here on YouTube. I will let her introduce herself here. Hi guys, my name is Amy and I do lots of lifestyle and mummy related content. On my channel you'll find lots of cleaning, day in the life, food hauls, vlogs, things like that. So yeah, if you're into that kind of thing then after watching Alyssa's video it will be amazing if you just pop on over to my channel and just check it out, see if there's anything you like. And yeah, I had the most amazing time doing this collab, so big thank you to Alyssa. And yeah, I hope to see you guys soon. Enjoy the collab. Everything you need to find Amy will be linked in the description box below. Make sure to go check her out. She has amazing mommy content, cleaning content, workout content, and she also lives on the other side of the world and has the most amazing views. And she shares them on her channel all the time. And I appreciate that because the views from my house is other houses. <laughs> Make sure to go check her out. Leave her a comment letting her know that you came from over here. And without further ado, let's just get right into it. Also, hello 911. Somebody ransacked this place. <laughs> just kidding. It was me. Let's do it. So I think the game plan is I'm going to start at the top and work my way down. So I'm going to take everything off of these shelves, move them into my bedroom. Okay, you know what? That's a lie. I don't want to take everything off the shelves. I don't want to do this at all. So let's not make it harder than it needs to be. Let's just tidy what's going on here. Let's make this make sense. I hate cleaning closets. Talk to me nice. Talk to me honestly. Look in my eyes. Don't let it fall on me. Say you a good guy. Make me believe it. Don't wanna hear it. I wanna see you. See how. So I went to private school like my whole life and I couldn't throw away my skirt. It's too sentimental and. I can't do it, you guys. I'm keeping one. I had like a billion in 12, so I feel like one's not too bad. But would this be a dumb thing to put in our special box? I'm doing it. It's okay. Don't judge me. John will never know. He never opens this thing. Okay, now up here, I think that I really do have to take everything down and take it into my bedroom because I don't know what's going on up there. I've been tossing things up there for like a year and it's gotten out of hand. So. My mom keeps telling me I have her purse and I keep telling her, no, I gave it back to you. Turns out I have her purse. I wanna see you, see my closet is actually stuff that belongs to my mom. I need to get better at giving stuff back. Okay, so let's get real. I know that I need to keep my purses up there because that's where they go. And then my boots, I want to keep my boots up there too. Guys, if you could see what's happening on the floor right now, and the sad part is it's not just because I've been cleaning stuff and putting it down there. Um, it was already down there before the video started, but we'll get there. Look at there. I'm the type that when I get a purse, I use it for such a long time. And this was my first big adult purchase back in college when I was working at an outlet mall and there was a Kate Spade in the outlets and it was on super sale, but I used it for years. I can't get rid of it is the thing. Um, I think this might be her purse too that she told me I stole. So that back to her oh my gosh is this my old license look at that <laughs> here i am <laughs> oh my gosh i absolutely love clips like this and i have like none left because they're probably in all of my freaking purses don't deny that i could do some company To show you guys the floor. Brace yourselves, don't judge me. Well, here's little Cooper, first of all. 
then also, here is all of this junk. So, oh, wow. Just want your time. I can't be the only person that has like so many pairs of shoes because you never throw pairs of shoes away because you never know when you're gonna want to wear that exact pair of shoes. progress okay so this area John just like piles things up and so do I you'll see underneath all of John's stuff is my stuff so let's just get into it I found this lipstick in one of my purses and lipstick is so expensive especially this one I think it's like 20 something bucks but it's so good I would say yeah it lasts like close to 24 hours I don't know I love it John walks around in blankets all day and then he just leaves them about the house. <laughs> so that doesn't belong here. So you took me by surprise. Oh uh, yeah. for Halloween and John was a fisherman so cute insert picture here so I was like his catch I just realized I never did a before shot and I am kicking myself but you guys saw it in the process but I will do an after here in a second Okay, I have decided to declutter a little bit, so let's just do it.
problem I'm having is I have a lot of work clothes, but I work from home. So, do I still need them? You know what? Executive decision. Most of the work clothes that I have are from like five years ago when I first got into an office job. So those I'm gonna throw away. And then there's a handful that I bought recently because I was like, you know what, I've had these for like five years. I should really up my wardrobe because I wear the same five shirts every week. But those five shirts I'm gonna throw away or donate. Let's, let's check them out. Again, I wore them a lot. I love this shirt so much, but I've had it for years. Okay, this is a romper <laughs> that I have had for years and I love it, but nobody else likes it. I really love it. I always feel pretty in it, which I don't understand because nobody has ever, I get a lot of people telling me that this is so ugly. But I can't get rid of it because it makes me feel good, so I'm keeping it until further notice. I feel like that looks better. I tried to color code it. Everything looks wrinkly in my closet. What is up with that? Do y'all iron your clothes? I don't unless I'm gonna wear it and it's wrinkly. I don't iron it beforehand, but maybe I should. And that is it, you guys. Thank you so much for coming on this journey with me and watching today's video. Don't forget to check out Amy's channel and video linked in the description box below. Thank you, Amy, for doing this collaboration with me. Like this video if you enjoyed it. Comment and let me know if you keep your closet clean or a mess like mine. And subscribe if you want to stick around. I'll see you guys next time.